Andy McCarthy describes the legal standard in this case. The law does not require a showing of any harm to, to anyone. This is the How weird was that? That's my adding. The state need not prove that the defendant ever intended to defraud anyone, much less actually defrauded someone. It Great word. Need not be established that any creditor or financial institution even relied on the defendant's misrepresentations, that those misrepresentations were material, or that anyone was actually fooled by them. This that actually was pretty funny. <laughs> the state just has to show that a defendant made false claims with enough, with enough persistence and repetition that at least two persons were, quote, affected. Which, whatever it means, is not a synonym for harmed. Based on that, they have gone in there and they are basically taking over Donald Trump's businesses. People are very likely to feel enraged by this. Or I guess the other half will just be thrilled it's a more of a pile on as they destroy this man's life.